Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how you can jailbreak your device with the latest iOS version, that is 13.2, by going on to iosjailbreak.pw. And you guys can see currently I have iOS 13.2, which is the latest iOS version, and I'm going to go ahead and go to this website, iosjailbreak.pw, which by the way is the only website right now where you're able to jailbreak the latest iOS version 13.2. And once you go ahead and go into this website, all you have to do is scroll to the top and you guys will see um, right there it says verify compatibility so go ahead and press that button and once you hit that button it's going to redirect you here and it's just going to ask for you to select your apple device as well as your ios version and once you go ahead and select your apple device and ios version which by the way the latest one's at the top um, go ahead and hit the verify compatibility button and then now it's just going to process your request and make sure your device is compatible for this jailbreak and you guys will see here once this process is complete um, a button will appear that says jailbreak so go ahead and hit that blue button and once you hit that button it's going to start downloading the jailbreak files and then it's going to start extracting them and this also includes files such as Cydia so once this download is complete um, you're going to have to go ahead and do some human verification. So just hit the blue human verification button. The reason this human verification is just to verify you're a human and not a bot. And it's very easy to do the human verification. All you have to do is install two apps from this list and follow the instructions below each app you install. So I'm going to go ahead and hit tap to install this first app. It's going to then redirect me to the app store where I can then start installing this first app. Then I'll go back onto the list of apps and just choose the second app. Hit tap to install. Same thing here. Redirects me to the app store and then I can start installing the second app as well. And now I'll just go ahead and wait for the installation of both apps to complete. And you guys will also notice that these apps are very small in size, so they download relatively quickly. So anyways, um, for some reason, it's making me put in my password for this app. I don't know why. Um, just randomly happened. Didn't do that for the first app. But um, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and just do that. And okay, now, now it can start downloading the second app. And uh, back to what I was saying, I can just wait for the installation of both apps to complete. And I can see this app's already done downloading. So I'm going to go ahead and start this app. So it's important you read the instructions below each app you install because each app might have specific instructions such as this one. So for this one, I have to make sure I register for an account because those are what the instructions told me to do on the app. So I'm going to go ahead and make sure I follow this five-step registration process and register for this account successfully. And once I've successfully registered for the account, uh, I still have to spend a few more seconds on the app because you need to remember that on each app, you have to spend at least 30 seconds on it. So I'm just gonna spend a few more seconds on this app. And once I've been on this app for at least 30 seconds and followed the instructions successfully, I can get off the app and go into the next app. So for this app, there's no specific instructions. All I have to do is just make sure I'm on this app for at least 30 seconds. And during the 30 seconds, I'm doing human interactions on the app. And you guys can see here, I'm just gonna simply accomplish that by poking around on these cards. Uh, nothing too complicated. Just make sure you're interacting with the app. And uh, you guys will see here that once you've successfully completed the human verification for both apps, you can just go ahead and boot off your device and turn it back on. And you guys will notice here that once you turn your device on, it will be success successfully jailbroken. And you guys will see that because Cydia will now be in the background of your device. And of course, you can go ahead and open up Cydia and do whatever you plan to do with your newly jailbroken device. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. And remember to follow all the instructions of this video by going on iosjailbreak.pw. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, uh, thank you for watching and have a good one.